Thomas and friends, making tracks to great destinations. Dear Christopher, here is your friend Thomas the Tank Engine. He wanted to come out of his station yard and see the world. These stories tell you how he did it. I hope you will like them because you helped me to make them. Your loving daddy. One day, Thomas and his wife at the station. There was a very special passenger on there. It was the judge. The judge had quite much to care about. Take me to the train show as fast as you can, Thomas, said the judge. Yes, sir, and Thomas pumped the way with the judge. So Thomas walked and he walked. He pumped faster and faster. But because he went so fast, the judge's head was lost. But then Thomas has to slow down. Wait, why are we slowing down? said the judge. Oh, I don't know, said Thomas. Then Thomas saw some cows on the wine. He suddenly stopped. Move, says Thomas. Move, says the cow. No, 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 said Thomas. Not move, move. At last, some of the cows moved, and Thomas pumped away as fast as he could. But it wasn't very long until Thomas reached another problem. There were some logs onto the track. I just seem to bash my way through, said Thomas. So he backed up, and he bashed through the logs. But the bottom torture is not over with Thomas yet, as he reaches through the tunnel on the other side, and then he saw some big mud puddle. He tried to stop, but it was too late. Thomas splashed into the puddle. But Thomas had no time to stop. He had to get to the train show before it starts. Everybody saw Thomas pass, but he had no time to say hello. Soon, Thomas had arrived at the train show, and just in time. Phew, said Thomas. I made it at last. You know, it's kind of hard to decide which engine I prefer. And besides, all you are really useful engines. But if I have to pick one, it will be Thomas. Thomas was happy indeed. <laughs> 